Yeah, so-called uh, I-24 uh, broke the story yesterday that this meeting that was scheduled in Cordoba next week between the UN's point man on anti-Semitism, Miguel Mortinos, and Jewish leaders and international anti-Semitism envoys is postponed. Now we find out today what's the reasoning behind it. Well, we got a confidential copy of Mortinos' draft plan to fight anti-Semitism, and it is very much what we thought it was going to be, which in the words of several would-be attendees is quote, deeply flawed and generated much criticism. Also, not a serious initiative was a quote out of another would-be attendee. Basically, it doesn't do much to fight anti-Semitism within the building behind us, the UN, which is what so many Jewish leaders and international anti-Semitism envoys have been complaining about. Not that the plan should be focused outwardly on anti-Semitism, which so many agencies across the world are really focusing on, but more in the building behind us. We saw the anti-Semitism plan. It does not adopt or embrace any definition of anti-Semitism. It gives the widely accepted IHRA, International Holocaust Remembrance Alliance definition, the same weight as more fringe definitions of anti-Semitism, which is critical because if it doesn't define it, then you really can't fight it, as we well know, Kalev. It also doesn't include any penalties for anti-Semitic activities for UN employees. It offers some basic recommendations on things like bias training, but it leaves, it really tosses the buck two member states to deal with anti-Semitism, rather than being dealt with in the halls of the UN itself. We spoke with representatives from the American Jewish Committee and B'nai B'rith International, two representatives who are supposed to attend those meetings next week. They said it's not even worth going, which is why it was postponed to begin with, basically saying if that's the plan that the UN is offering, there's nothing really to talk about. Keep in mind, Caleb, this has been a plan that's three years in the works. And Martinos told us back in February the reason it's been so long in the making is because he thought having meetings, dozens of meetings with Jewish leaders to gauge their concerns would lead to a better, more concise plan overall. Obviously, that's not the case right yeah. now. The meeting has been postponed till September. Don't be surprised if it goes longer than that. And by the way, Caleb, the spokesman for the UN uh, Secretary General, Antonio Guterres, told us moments ago that Guterres condemns anti-Semitism in all its manifestations, not just the old, but the new. But he said that the draft plan is just that, a draft. It's not the final plan, and that there are consultations still ongoing.